Hey there guys, Foxy Fern here and welcome back to Foxy Farm in Stardew Valley. Today it is raining out. Let's see what our luck is like. Mildly perturbed. Alright, so there's a few things we are not going to want to do today because it will just make us want to pull our hair out. So since it is raining, we do not have to water any of our crops. Therefore, I think today would make a good day to go and try and meet some people. Check out how many we have left. 12 out of 28. And you can also see your social tab by pressing E and jumping over to the little heart here. So we have all of these people left to meet. Oh dear me. Well, let's go ahead and get started. Oh hey, look here. Let's pluck a few things. Dandelions and daffodils. Do you mind if I do? Is that it? Yes. Looks like it is. Nothing is open right now. Everybody is still asleep. So let's go head over to the beach and see if there's anything to collect. Oh, that's right. We also need to get our 300... Whoa, cockle. I don't think I've ever seen a cockle on this beach before. Is that all we got? Just one cockle, nothing else? I don't even know what that is. Common saltwater clam. I'm not much of one for clams. Although, I guess I shouldn't knock it till I try it, right? Because I am not sure I've actually ever had a clam. I ate an oyster for my first time not too long ago and let's just say it tasted like the ocean for sure but it was also very salty and I really like salty things I think I could maybe acquire the taste but it wasn't really something I would generally go to a place and order so we already meet this fellow Oh no! Damn it, Clint, I didn't want to actually give that to you, but at least you didn't hate it. Er, hi, I'm Clint. Yes. Hi, Clint. You are Clint, who I gave you my flower before I even introduced myself, so you must think I'm a pretty big weirdo. Let's see if there's anybody in Joja Mart, aka Walmart. I don't think we can actually talk to these people. Welcome to Joja Mart! How are you doing today? I'm not going to become a Joja customer. Maybe. Maybe someday. Not today. Can we talk to you? No? Fine. You're just another drone. Oh my gosh, these are actually way cheaper than Piers. He wasn't kidding. Wow. Do I want to be that person? Do I want to buy these cheaper seeds? Hmm. I'm going to be that person, guys. I'm going to be that terrible, terrible person. This is, uh, this is like me, IRL. If I'm too poor to buy things, I have to go buy them from the big conglomerates. Now I'm finally at a place in my life where I actually can afford to shop local, but, you know... There were some times back in the day where I wasn't so fortunate. Oh, closed on Wednesdays. Wednesdays. We met the doctor yet? Hello. No. Yikes. Why is that stuff so expensive? What is that? Oh. That's a lot of energy. 500 energy. My goodness, that must be for much later in the game because... I don't have anywhere close to that right now. Okay, can I come behind the counter here and say hello to you? Hi! It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Harvey, the local doctor. That is quite the strange mustache you have. So, no peers today. That's quite a bummer because that's a good place to go meet a bunch of people. Now, we can go inside people's houses, and if they're just hanging out in the living room, we can say hello to them, but we can't go back in their rooms unless we're friends with them, which is 
still really, really weird. I don't, I don't think I would appreciate somebody just walking into my house, but there you have it. Oh, a stranger. My name's Vincent. Mama says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. Is this your mama? Oh, you aren't exactly how I imagined, but that's okay. I'm Jody. Nice to meet you, Jody. Not sure if that was a backhanded compliment or just a straight up insult. And Sam, come talk to me, Sam. No. Okay. Who else can we meet? I have no clue what that sound is. It must be like some magical frog or something. Oh, so Leah, you can't go into her house, even though you can go into everybody else's house. Maybe hers is just, oh, one room or something. Oh my goodness, so many people meet. Hey, little girl. <laughs> Hi. Cool, you're friendly. Glad your mama taught you some manners. Hi, Fern. You look like you're soaked, you poor thing. Oh, thank you for your concern. That's so nice of you. Can I not see what you have for sale? Fine. Be a jerk. There. Supplies. Ha! <laughs> you can buy a heater for your animals. That's adorable. What else do you have? Oh, just animals. Yep. We gotta, we gotta make our buildings for those first. All right, well, since it's raining and nobody else wants to go outside, how about we just chop down some more wood so that we can go open up that bridge ASAP? How does that sound? Actually, how about we plant our cauliflower seeds first? That sounds like a better idea. We don't even have to water them. Hooray! All right. Time to be a lumberjack. Yeah, one other thing I should mention is that if you use your side to get rid of these weeds that are sitting around instead of like another tool, which you can use pretty much any tool to get rid of them, but if you use your side, then you have the chance to get some mixed seeds that will be a mystery of what they grow, but still a lot of fun. And I accidentally just killed that tree. Oh. All right, well, we did not quite get enough wood for the making the bridge and we're out of energy. So we're gonna go ahead and call it a short day. All that chopping down wood is really tiring, you know? We didn't make very much money today either, but that's okay. Some days, some days your life is just like that. Living off the land. Spring onion southwest of town where the river meets the ocean. You can sometimes find a whole bunch growing right out of the dirt. All right, I will do that. I tend to forget about that a lot. Perturbed again? Man, that is no good. Well, let's go ahead and water our crops and then we'll go check for those spring onions. How's that sound? All right, let's go check out what the south side of town has to offer. Ah! If I can make my way through here, this horrific mess. Do 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 do. Is there anything to collect today? Nope. No can do. Aha! Ah! Oh, stop wasting your energy. Actually, I'm wrong. The Psy doesn't waste energy, so if you are going to have something equipped and it's a tool, then it might as well be the Psy so that you don't waste any energy. Ooh, all sorts of stuff together. Hooray! Oh, looky there. We do get some spring onions. Mmm, nom 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 nom. Those do not restore very much health, but perhaps we'll get a cooking recipe that we can use them in. Let's go see if there's anyone else new to meet in town. Ah, here we go. Oh. You've already said hello to me. Miss Penny and doing all of her yoga under the tree. 
Hey there, creepy mayor. How's it going? Let me guess, are you gonna say something really, really weird? A saloon can get pretty lively at night. Sometimes we even put a coin in the jukebox. <laughs> yes, you did say something really creepy. I... Wow. That... Yeah, just... Wow. That's all I have to say. Hey there, Mr. Jock Kid. Hey, you're the new girl, huh? I think we're gonna get along great. I'm Alex. You know what? I don't think we are gonna get along great because I am not into football and you obviously very clearly are. What quest do we have today? Trying to keep the Ardo fishing alive. I will pay 100 gold to any fishing enthusiast who catches two smallmouth bass. Good luck, Willy. Smallmouth bass. Maybe we'll do that later today. Anybody else in the shop? Nope. Go have a cozy by the fire. Ooh, what's this? Altar of Yoba. Okay. That's cool. That's not strange at all. Ooh, we have a nurse lady this time. Is she somebody I get to meet? Oh! Aren't you the one who just moved in? I'm Aru. I've been looking forward to meeting you. Oh, you're much more friendly than half the people in this town. Thank you, Maru. Oh. Oh, here's a fun one. Hey there, Chica. I've decided I'm going to organize my clothes today. I'll have to throw out all of last year's styles to make room for the new ones. Oh, isn't that a shame? Ooh, I bet Pam will be in her trailer. Let's go just walk right into her trailer. Oh, there, there she is. Hey, Pam. Hey, kid, the name's Pam. I gathered that. Well, I cheated. I already knew who you were. Do you got anybody else in here? Are you hiding any bodies or anything? Nope. Okay, cool. Let's go see if we can catch some fish for Willy. I'm correct, the smallmouth bass is swimming in the river, so let's give it a try. Ew. Oh! Oh man, that's so hard early on. Sunfish, that's not what we want. Screw you, sunfish. Yay, smallmouth bass. One down, one to go. Driftwood. Well, we actually want to hang on to garbage unless we run out of inventory space because we get to use trash for later on. I will not give you any spoilers, but just tell you to hang on to any trash that you get from fishing. Because it doesn't sell for anything right now, but you can make use of it in the future. Hmm. Now we need to throw something away. I'm gonna throw away my fiber because I generally get way too much of that as it is. But I did want to keep this green algae because it's a nice little thing that you can eat to gain energy. More sunfish. We'll go ahead and give that a nibble. Mmm, algae, so tasty. Hooray! Now we'll go give Willie his fish. Apparently he is too inept to fish for himself, even though he taught us how to fish, but that's okay. Means more money for us. Hey, where really? Hey, you succeeded, Fern! The smallmouth bass is an exciting catch, don't you think? Sometimes they seem so smart, it's scary. Scary! <laughs> well, here's your reward. Congratulations. Aw, oh, thank you so much. Actually, rewards from quests are generally pretty good because even though I didn't... Oh, I even got to keep the fish. Wow, that was great. Super great. Oh, hey. Ah, the new farmer we've all been expecting, and whose arrival has sparked many a conversation. I'm Elliot. I live in the little cabin by the beach. 
It's a pleasure to meet you. You too, pretty boy. Your hair is longer than mine, but hey, that's okay. We have so many things we get to sell today. We should go chop down some more wood. Oh, hey, look, some wormies. So, can't remember if I told you guys this, guys this or not yet, but if you see these little worm things wiggling around on the ground, you should take your hoe and give them a whack because you get things like this. A cool book that will tell us neat things if we go visit it in the museum and, and read it. All right, I think we'll finish the day off by chopping down some more wood so that we can open up that bridge soon. Sorry about that, that was my web browser making noise. Oh, there we go. 100 gold for a fish, hooray. So later on, I tend to not try and do the quests that don't really make all that much money unless I really have nothing to do during that day because generally there will be other things that are more money making like going into the mines that I will not want to waste my time by something so minuscule like that for a hundred gold. All right, we will now have enough wood for the next day when we want to go open up the bridge. And then we can collect all sorts of goodies from the other side. All right, let's... I guess I'll hang on to the spring onion for now just because I don't really know what we'll use it for later, but we'll drop these other things in our box over here and get a little cash. All right. Nighty night. Level one fishing, plus one fishing rod proficiency. Woohoo. So if I remember correctly, the proficiency of a tool increasing will reduce the amount of energy that you spend while using that tool. So it definitely comes in handy for you being able to do more things. All right, guys, I think that is a good stopping point for this episode of Stardew Valley. Thank you so much for joining me on Foxy Farm, and I look forward to seeing you next time.